I just think they're really freaking cool. Fun facts? Fun facts about comas, or people who came out of comas, actually. So I've got about, I've got a couple of them. <laughs> I'll start with the coolest ones, I think. So um, <laughs> this three-year-old girl from China or somewhere in Asia, I, I don't know, I just saw her picture, so I know she's Asian, <laughs> but it didn't specify. So, but she woke up from a five-day coma and she now smokes and drinks on a daily basis. And she smokes up to a pack a day. How old is she? Three years old. How can you... She got in a car accident, went into a coma, came out, and is smoking cigs and booze. So like, like her, it's no So business. someone has to give them to her? I think it said her dad did because it said like her dad smokes two packs a day and she smokes one. Crazy, right? A three-year-old cannot just wake up and be like... Mm, I smoke now. Someone, <laughs> give me a pack. Yeah, that one. And they're just like, oh, I guess she smokes now. Here we go. So anyways, that's interesting. Okay, but. there's more though. <laughs> um, 41 days in a coma. This 22-year-old boy, his mother, his sweet mother was beside him every single day. Every She was there waiting for him to come alive and say something to her. And he finally wakes up and all he has to say is, F you to his mother. <laughs> that, those were his first words, and it said in the article, she was ecstatic. She was like, she, I guess she didn't care. You know, I would be excited if, you know, I was waiting for someone to wake up for that long. They could say whatever they want when they woke up. I would be excited no matter what. It would be awesome, right? That okay, this, awesome. this is a really funny one. A grandpa from Switzerland fell out of a plum tree, his hey. family's plum tree, <laughs> four days in a coma, woke up as a sex addict. Hmm. I don't know. Is that more believable than the cigs and drinking baby? Maybe. You know what I'm thinking? I think what happened was a creepy old man went into a coma. <laughs> he was already a sex addict. <laughs> and, and he came out of the coma. Oh, he, And he's like, oh, yeah, I'm a sex addict now because of the coma. It did something to my brain. I'm not like this. <laughs> I'm not usually creepy. See, Just, I, I don't think of it. these things. I actually feel bad for these people, but you're making me see Not that me. they're all a bunch of lies. <laughs> Wait, okay. <laughs> I might as well say them all because there's only two more. This woman falls into a coma, like kind of like a, narcolep a narcoleptic, yeah. I guess, when she falls asleep. But she'll, she'll go into this coma, like, it says waking sleep, every time she tells her kids that she loves them. Like a trance, so, kind of? Kind of. Every time, you know, mommy says, I love you, she, like, goes night-night for, like, a little while. But, like, mm. I don't know about that. Well, that's what you learn. A lesson learned. Don't tell your kids that you love them. Nope. So, mm -hmm. it's as simple as that. <laughs> You're horrible. And then, three-year-old, after a five-day coma, wakes up singing the Mamma Mia song by ABBA. Oh, boy. Yeah. You know what would have been crazy, though? Da, 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 da. If she never even heard the song before, I that would freak me out. Well, has she? She's three. I don't know. I guess so. I didn't read that far into the article. Maybe she had never heard like, it. Like, I hear stories she about, She was like, from, like, no, she was from, like, some weird country. Hmm. Like, I hear stories about people who, like, are getting exorcisms and stuff, and they, like, or, you know, have, like, split personalities. That's someone just like me and you who never even... I don't know, like, learn another language, I guess, if you don't know another language. And they, like, be, like, bipolar and they go to their other personality. And they can speak Yeah, it's different crazy. Language. Even though, I guess, bipolar doesn't give you, you know, split personalities. That's something different. But anyways, you know what I mean. Yeah, that's bizarre. I don't know. But the picture, she had meningitis. And it looked like she was from some, like, poorer country. Mm, who knows? I don't know. I, I'm putting enough. it. Uh, I don't know. So you're putting this on the uh, believable list or are you calling BS? Is that what you're trying to say? I'm calling BS on a couple of them. The plum but tree? I, <laughs> definitely the plum tree. But I kind of do believe the baby, the smoking baby. Because, I mean, if you think about it in Asia, like, think about how many people smoke cigarettes. Like, I've seen pictures of, like, like eight-year-olds smoking cigs. You know, three's not that far off from eight, five years. She's I'm, just getting a little bit of a head start. Yeah, good for you. You go, girl.